My name is Mark Kurth. I'm the proud mayor of Lexington, Minnesota, and here's what's happening this fall. We'll start street sweeping. Uh, once, the fall, once the leaves all fall down to the ground, we don't want to do it and then have to go back out and do it again. Uh, remember, there's no parking on city streets uh, from 2 a.m. to 6 a.m. Uh, after November 1st until April 1st. And then we'll also be starting to prep our hockey rink. So I want to see everybody out there skating this year. Hopefully the weather will cooperate, but we are going to put that liner down again. And we're going to have the hockey rink. It's going to have lights. It's going to be on a timer. So we're looking for more people to start using that more so we can continue to use it. Uh, so election day is upon us. You can vote right here at City Hall. Uh, you can also register here at City Hall. Uh, you can uh, vote early our absentee vote. You do everything here right at City Hall. It's the only precinct that, that we have, so it's pretty easy to, to, to do. Construction updates are we're finishing up the Ephesians. Uh, just talked to the owner. Looks like they're going to be wrapping it up probably Janu between January 1st and Valentine's Day, he said. Uh, we're also finalizing the plans for new O'Reilly's building, and we're wrapping up the building for the level building. Uh, we're hopefully going to close on that soon and groundbreaking should be about the middle to the end of November. So a lot going on in the city of Lexington. Fall festival just wrapped up. The turnout was absolutely amazing. I could not be happier. Uh, three years ago, I had a vision of what we wanted it to be and we saw that come to fruition. It was, I couldn't be happier with the turnout. Uh, we had bouncy houses, we had a petting zoo, we had a rock climbing wall, we had trampoline bouncing, we had uh, dunk tanks, we had the fire open house, we had the 5k, uh, there was a lots of things to do for the family and friends and I, like I said I couldn't be happier to see the, the turnout that we had. We already are setting up for next year so next year it's looking like it's going to be September 20th through the 22nd of 2019 and it'll be located right where it was again. So we put about nine months worth of planning on it uh, and I know people like the fireworks, so the fireworks will be back as well. Public safety, you know, school's back in session, so you wanna make sure that you're driving slow through their city streets, looking for children. You know, generally, if you see a ball bouncing out in the yard, there's a child, a child coming after it, so just watch, watch your speed, watch where you're going. I know we've had uh, some complaints uh, about the speeding on Level Road, so police are actively enforcing the speed limit on Level Road, so please, 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 Watch your speed. We don't want to get unnecessary speeding tickets or accidents or whatever, uh, but they are actively enforcing that. So our goals for this year are to uh, pass, the, pass the budget. We're looking for good things to come out of that. Hopefully people will see lower property taxes. And we want to make sure that people get out and vote this year. Uh, this is an election year, so exercise that right.